Hey there everyone, welcome back to Tuber Gaming. Need for Speed has a list of games that provide the perfect adrenaline rush for racing fans. Throughout its history, it has gone through endless changes and makeovers that have made it one of the most beloved games of all times. Well, let's head on and check its evolution since 1994. Before we begin, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of our upcoming videos. All right, now let's begin. Number five, The Beginning, 1994 to 2000. Need for Speed opened the franchise with an average looking game. As the resolutions available at that time were quite low, the game didn't look great in visuals considering modern games. However, there were lots of interesting content in the game, which included exotic cars, police chases, and a number of maps. It was a great game during its time. The next installment was one of the biggest hits. Still remembered by old players, Need for Speed 2 SE was a game that inspired future racing titles. While providing different car classes and beautiful locations, there were cheat codes that the players could use for fun. It also featured certain difficulties for opponents and game modes. The next three titles in the franchise were NFS 3 Hot Pursuit, NFS 4 High Stakes, and Porsche Unleashed. But they were somewhat similar to the previous two. While they received names, the company managed to bring some new changes to each title, adding cop cars, innovative HUD designs, and several other features. Porsche Unleashed was an NFS title dedicated entirely to the renowned car brand. The game received mixed reviews because of many aspects, and the company took a year's break for the next title. Number 4. The Golden Era 2002-2008 The golden age of the franchise started with Need for Speed Hot Pursuit 2. This game was a complete makeover, and the fans loved it. The graphics, mechanics, and everything was improved, paving the way for future titles. Need for Speed 6 led the way for the next series of the most popular racing titles of all time. Need for Speed Underground and Underground 2 were quickly sold out soon after their release. The customization, player campaign, soundtracks, map design, and mechanics made fans fall in love with them. Even today, millions of racing fans play the game for a surge of nostalgia and even more remember these titles for the endless hours of joy that they brought. In 2005, EA Games released their most iconic title, Need for Speed Most Wanted. It defined the idea behind a racing game and set the standard extremely high. Every detail about the game was inch perfect. In such a compact size, EA created a game that needed very minimal computer specifications to run. While the game had quite similar graphics to those of the previous title, other features like soundtracks, cars, mechanics, police interaction, and other aspects were defined on a new scale. Players fell in love with the story of the single-player campaign, and the online racing was a huge success. It was truly a game meant for all generations to play. Need for Speed Carbon, Pro Street, and Undercover were titles that couldn't become a great hit. Although Need for Speed Carbon became a mere shadow of its predecessor, providing slower mechanics and racing in darker times. Need for Speed Undercover couldn't turn enough heads due to the lack of creativity and extremely easy opposition. Moreover, the leveling system was a failure and the company took a significant loss. Number 3. The Redemption 2009 to 2013 In 2009, EA released Need for Speed Shift. Players were introduced to newer atmosphere and the mechanics felt totally new. However, the reviews were still quite mixed as there was a lack of content in the game. Need for Speed World came out in 2010, but couldn't gather positive reviews. Although the game provided features from Need for Speed Most Wanted and Carbon, it eliminated the single-player campaign, which made critics review the game badly. The arrival of Need for Speed Hot Pursuit in 2010 blew people's minds. Criterion Games provided the exact package that the racing fans were expecting. Five car classes featuring the hottest supercars worldwide with marvelous handling and mechanics combined with a police force relentlessly bringing racers down through technology. This game was certainly the point where the franchise was reborn. 2011 saw Need for Speed receive two completely different titles. Need for Speed Shift 2 was quite similar to the first shift with very minor improvements. Meanwhile, Run became a good success story for the company providing a new twist for racing fans with the story, vehicles, and mechanics. Need for Speed Most Wanted received a reboot in 2012, 
which was praised by critics in lots of ways. Although the vehicle unlocking system was quite unfair and irrational, the game's mechanics and simple storyline made fans like the title all the more. 2013 saw the arrival of Need for Speed Rivals, which was another successful title in the franchise. The game had all the features that made it worthy of the accolades that it achieved that year. It was even compared to several other titles in the franchise due to resemblance in mechanics and gameplay. Number 2. A Minor Setback 2015 Need for Speed released Need for Speed in 2015. While the game received great reviews for its visuals and world detailing, there were other features that made the game a failure. As the game was completely online, players lost the ability to pause the game at an instance. Moreover, the developers removed the choice of transmission, making everybody play the same way. Need for Speed No Limits was a title made solely for phones, and received praise for customization, graphics, and handling. <clears throat> Number 1. Current Hits 2017 to 2019 EA is currently thriving on its hits from 2019 and 2017. Need for Speed Payback came out in 2017 and was applauded by everyone for its gameplay, mechanics, storyline, and car options. The game also offered heavy customization for the cars, so everyone could have an opportunity of making their dream car the way they want. The current running success of the company is Need for Speed Heat which was released two years ago. Like Need for Speed Payback, it also offered a completely new sense of mechanics for the racing fans, and an intricate storyline. Moreover, the developers took great care of keeping the customization option intact for everyone, making this game a potent competitor for other titles like Forza Horizon 4 and Gran Turismo. While the debate for the best racing franchise continues, fans are quite certain that Need for Speed wins it by an inch. In 27 years of development, fans have seen revolutions of changes. These games have defined the childhoods of millennials, and nobody is ever going to forget about these titles. Well, this brings us to the end of our video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you haven't liked the video yet, do so. It's never too late. Give it a thumbs up, people. We will soon see you in another video. Until then, take care and goodbye.